Hi guys, it's your girl Kill Chemist, and I'm popping on with a quick outfit of the day, face of the day, hair of the day video. So let's get started. So my hair, I basically redid that same pompadour style, and I am going to get that tutorial uploaded. Give me until the weekend at least. I'm going to try to do it tonight, but it's been a crazy week. So what I actually did though in the front, instead of having it hang really low, I swept it and lifted it upward and off my face. Um, the reason I did that is because while I love the style, throughout the course of the day the other day, the hair hanging on my forehead which is, just started to irritate me. I'm not really good with hair on my forehead and face. Uh, my skin tends to break out, you know, from the oils and things. I didn't get any breakouts, but it just was getting on my nerves. So I decided to make it a little funky and flip it back today. Um, on my face, I have, uh, if you guys remember those little L.A. Colors um, eyeshadow palettes that I had, I used the natural eye one. There's a kind of a hmm, corally berry color in there that I put all over my lid, and I used one of the browns in my crease. I don't know how well you can see that because my lights are so intense. So it looks more neutral, but there is more of a corally color on my eye. On my cheeks, I have Hips Blendable Blushing Cream in Electrify. And on top of that, just to kind of blend it down a bit, I use the Candid Coral um, Elf Studio Blush. And on my lips, I just grab some stuff. I use this Maybelline Lip Express Pencil in Runaround Brown that I got from the Dollar Tree. And over top, an old lip gloss that I got from Avon. I don't even remember the brand or color or anything other than I know it came from Avon. So that's that. In my ears, you've probably seen this jewelry set before. I think I paid like a dollar. I also have it in green and brown. Um, but I have these hoops with the like corally red and brown and also this corally red and brown. It's actually just two straight necklaces that I twisted and I secured them in the back actually with a safety pin so that they're more of a choker style because of the neckline of the dress that I'm wearing. I'm also wearing this ring that I think I got, I can't remember, but it wasn't very expensive. And I don't really have a bracelet on right now and I don't think I'm going to wear one. Um, and now to the outfit. So today I am wearing this very simple little sheath dress. This is by Ann Klein. But I did not get it from Ann Klein. Of course, you know your girl. I went thrifting. I think I paid three or four dollars for this dress. Uh, it's a very simple little dress. I used to dislike it because I wish that the neckline uh, was a little lower. But um, and it's such a wide kind of just hanging cut. So I belted it at the waist um, so that it looks more flattering to the figure. But it's that nice kind of stretchy poly blend fabric so it just kind of flows with you. It's a little short but I think because of the way I have it dressed up up top that will distract a little bit from the leg action I have going on. Um, so yes it's a bit above my knee but you know I think I can get away with it. It's still trying to be a little warm today. And then on the bottom because I'm going to work I'm wearing my little uh, chocolate brown patent leather flats. And so this is my outfit of the day, and you yeah, guys, one more day till the weekend. <laughs> See you later. Bye.